Hey, what's going on, Ogopogo? Back in subsistence. How the heck are ya? <laughs> how, the, how you been? You ready for the weekend? I am. I hope you are as well. Okay, we're gonna do a couple things around here today. Nothing too spectacular. I went and did a run down to the North Lake for some pearls. We're struggling with pearls. All I came back with was like eight. I just did my morning dip in the pond here and got one more out of the deal. So let's uh, concentrate. I think we better get ourselves prepped to get our diving station and stuff like that done. Uh, look at that. Kelp in there. I had a great run of kelp again when I came back, but pearls, not so much. Let's get a... Uh, Got a catfish and a pike, which wasn't too shabby. I guess we need something to eat too, hey? Let's have a liver and onions. Maybe a tomato. Have a drink. Let's get a few more bottles of water going here. So, we're going to... Uh, yeah, we're going to focus on getting our diving station going here. It's getting a little... Uh, Lame, we're gonna, you know, to make the circuit boards and stuff, we're gonna need lots of pearls. And my, like I've told you guys before, I find it's been in, in my seeds, at least, the South Lake is by far the best place for pearls, but you need the diving station, or, you know, the diving gear to get down there. Let's, uh, we were talking last episode, we were gonna get this extender going. I think it's five, but we'll take ten just to be safe. Let's get that extender going. I got the mass cranked up for it. Let's get that in place and then we can start plunking down some beds and get ourselves better situated with our plants. Uh, oh yeah, extender. There we go. Range extender. So let's do that and then we're going to start focusing on our diving station. Oh, there's a crate down there. And like I said, I think before we turn the attacks on, we may even uh, take a run down to... That is a builder's crate. Take a run down to Delta, raid them, and use their diving station to make an extra gear. But we'll build ourselves up. What I'll do is I'll do a little off-camera over the weekend. Maybe get Beach in here with me, and we'll get a bunch of logs and stuff chopped. Let's go. Oh, you know what? Before we do this, we should go grab these crates. Yeah, because it's difficult. Like, I mean, you can go around, swim around the shallow, you know, exterior of the North Lake and get some pearls. You have good days and bad days, but I find the North Lake is a lot better for sandstone. And I do, you know, I dip in my pond here every day. See what we can find, but it's hit and miss. So we got to get some diving gear going if we're going to advance further. Because we need lots of pearls. Upgrade the weapons. We need pearls. I just can't float around with, you know, like 10 pearls in the, in the inventory all the time. All right. This was that other one. Let's get that. Let's head over and drop this. Uh, we're going to need a little bit of building materials, I think. Make ourselves a quarter wall. Hey, chicken. Okay. So, let's get at it. Let's go... Put this stuff away. It's starting to overflow on all this stuff here, too. That's good. That's a good thing. Uh, that's why I don't like tapping into it if I don't have to. But that's what we've been able to build up just since we turned off the uh, the attacks. All right. What do we need for a quarter wall here? Not much. Two, five, and one. Let's make that. Let's go out and drop this guy in. Then we're all situated. Got room for this apple in there. 
Don't really need it right this minute. We'll just toss it in there for the time being. All right. Well, I think if we take out one of these guys. Actually, let's see. Let's escape that. Let's see where uh, I forget where this is now. Ah, so we got to do it here. like to have it tucked in if possible how high up off the rocks are we there not very well we can actually just do it here then let's uh take it off from this side Throw that down. Yeah, we'll just move it down a little bit. There we go. Yeah, it's... I like to get right on the edge, but we're so close to the rock there. We'll just set it there. Let's put it kind of up. So it gets protected a little bit. There we go. We may cover this in at some point down below there, but I kind of like having the stream run right through it. There we go. All right. Well, let's go uh, grab our plant beds and toss them down. Start moving them over. Might as well. Wouldn't mind running out for a bit, see if we can gather some nails and stuff. We're going to need them for building. Let's throw that there. Now I can kind of, maybe I could even think about getting rid of this uh, overhang because I like looking out the window and seeing the whole escape, you know. We'll see. I kind of got plans for this floor up here too eventually, but. All right. Now let's go. Uh, make ourselves another box is it 12 nails 10 and three of these guys let's make another one of those dudes let's uh, go grab all our seeds and our water and stuff oh shite that's no good. Okay, let's just leave some of the fertilizer in here. Oh, a little more. Come back for that. Uh, let's put it right in the center for now. Actually, no. Let's put it close to the water, watering hole here. Like I said, we're going to encase this in glass eventually. Let's put in our uh, canteens. And then we'll start putting that in. Let's put in our seeds down below here. We're going to have to start making more seeds as we grow now too. Getting a little low on some of that stuff. Okay, let's go uh, grab the rest of that. Fertilizer. Some of the ash I'm going to start uh, keeping down below. There, you know what? We'll put the chicken shit down here. For now there we go all right so let's figure this out then let's move these guys make sure we're not deleting them you know what we got lots right now so we'll just kind of space them out 
each one can have their own little foundation on the outside for now. Oh, went a little too far. Oh, go. Here, let's just move these over here and then we can arrange them. I think these carrots are ready anyway. Alright. Let's grab this dude. Eighty-five, hundred. Move. Maybe have to move that other guy. Let's move him over here. How's this one doing? That's a hundred. That's eighty-five. So wonder if we move this guy onto this triangle. That one's a hundred. That one's a hundred. There we go. Space them out a little bit. Perfect. So let's grab these carrots. And I think I only had five carrot seeds. So let's uh, make eight. I don't have to worry right at the moment about fertilizing. And we'll get a couple more plant beds made. Let's make uh, three more. So we've got a full bed. We've got a full bed of, well, lots of everything else at the moment. Okay, cool. There we go. Let's uh, take a run out. There's some rogues up above Charlie. I wouldn't mind uh, going to check out, but we'll uh, keep our eyes open for some nails along the way. Wanted to make a... Uh, I wanted to make a uh, lock pick today, but I thought this was a little bit more important to get it finished. All right. Well, we got one scrap on us. Let's rock out of here. We leave that back door open. It's not a big deal right now. <laughs> Close one and uh, leave the other one open. Do that all the time. All right. Well, let's head out and see what we can find. Do just do a little bit of looting around. Go visit the rogues. It's hotter than hell out here today. 26. And iron. We've got to get ourselves built back up on iron, too. So we may have to do a, a run down to, like, Hortastic Way. And we'll keep our eyes open around here. Been doing pretty good with the, uh... I was wondering if I was going to trigger him. Been doing pretty good with the ores around this area, so it's not that bad. Okay, let's skate around this guy here. Is that an iron or is that a potassium? That wolf is, yeah, he's coming up and over. Let's just keep moving. Go oh, up top there. I love it up top at that, uh, you know, that area above. Let's grab this chicken. Another thing I'm kind of low on is feathers. Got to get that built up. Using the bow an awful lot, which is a good thing. It's allowing us to save on ammo for the most part. You know, we went through quite a few shot shotgun shells when we were getting the sinew, but that's well worth it. That is well worth it. But I think we should do another round of raids before we turn everything back on. Maybe on the last raid we'll do, we'll uh, turn the, uh, the uh, revenge attacks back on before we go raid them. And that way we can get a... Uh, See how our defense area is going to work on us. Mind you, it doesn't really matter. We get those guys coming down to fish all the time. We could trigger a revenge attack anytime we want, really.
All right, let's see what's up around this way here. Not seeing much out here today. Little, uh... Little lacking in the crate department. So far. Oh, there's somebody over there fishing. wonder if that's, uh... Charlie. Looks like a hunter. No, it's a rogue. He's all the way down here. Let's go piss him off. Hey, buddy. Come here, man. I got to show you something. Uh, he's, they just got to get one shot in on you every time. We'll definitely take that. Let's eat that. Let's have a bandage. Got to make some more bandages here. How the hell did his blood spatter get all the way over there? I mean, it's a bow for crying out loud. <laughs> it isn't a lever action or something. That's crazy. Well, let's go see the rest of his boys. Most of them should be helmetless. We're lucky. Yeah, I need a good wood run again. Need some more uh, planks and nails and stuff so we can do some more building around the base there. I mean, I love the building. I just don't want to get at it too hard and fast and get everything done that quick. And then it's just like, what do we do, right? Then it's just raids and crap like that. We're going to start building a south base at some point, but... I'd love to get that done before winter if possible. So we can spend, uh, cause we're going to be spending, once we get our diving station, going to spend quite a bit of time. Over at that end, diving for pearls and stuff. I mean, once we get to get a little deeper in the North Lake too, the return isn't too terribly bad. It's just whether you get a good day or not that allows, you know, lots of, uh, Pearls around the shallow areas of the North Lake here. I mean, we'll keep... I keep going in my little pond every morning and checking that out. There's just not always a... A pearl in there. Oh, we need loads of them. So we gotta get in, uh, get deep and get them. So that's what we're gonna work on here. Like I said, over the weekend, I'll do some uh, off-camera. We'll get the power and mass built up so we can build our diving station. Then we'll probably go down to Delta. Raid them and use their diving station to make up, you know, either another uh, diving gear or some tanks or something. And we'll just keep stockpiling the tanks every time we raid them because they got that diving gear there, which is cool. They normally have close to 100 mass. You'd be able to get five tanks at a shot out of the deal. But I definitely want to use it to try to make a second diving set once we get our diving station down. And it'll be fun to get down into the caves as well. It'll give us some other options to... Uh, uh, you know what? I didn't grab another uh, pickaxe here. Another iron? Where were those rogues? I thought they were just up here somewhere. And I haven't seen them yet. I could have swore they were right up here. Unless I looked at the map too early. They might have been here from the night before. That's all right. Doesn't hurt to get out and loot. Look around, see what's going down. Another chicken. Come on. Oh, past a crate. Oh, you're going to bounce off the trees now, are you? Another one over here, too, now. There she goes. I'm going to get too close to Charlie. 
chasing chickens into their yard. <laughs> Where the hell did she go? Our little outpost is doing a good. Look at them all out here. Holy shit. This one's going up the hill. We'll go that way. And I gotta go back and get that crate. Passed a couple things on the way down that first chicken. There we go. Okay, where was that stuff now? I kind of chased her down this way. So we were heading down this way, kind of over these rocks, I think. Hope it's still there. There it is. That's it. Get them nails built up. Now, I thought I passed another honey somewhere too, but I'm trying to remember where the heck that was. One, two, three, four. So that's another eight feathers. Another 16 arrows. How are we sitting? We got 27 on us, but I used up most of the arrows that we had. All right, let's go grab this grub tree. Have a look down at Charlie, see what's going on there. Yeah, we would have went for Delta today and worked on the uh, diving station, but I had 10 pearls on me. We need five circuit boards. That would have wiped out our pearls, so... We'll do it on Monday. I'll do another uh, couple off-camera days here. Like I said, maybe get Beach in with me, get some wood and nails and stuff, and also maybe do another run around the North Lake and see if I can get another half dozen pearls or, or more. I think that's probably the way to go. Oh, rabbit. Charlie's looking decent. So we'll work on that next week. Let's do that. Let's make next week. We'll do another round of uh, of raids through the course of the week. Get our diving gear done, and then at the end of the week, we'll turn the uh, revenge attacks back on. I think we're built up enough now. And like I said, if it drains us out, we can always turn them back off for a little bit. But I just don't like doing that. I like to keep them on, but being a solo in a co-op play by our save, it's, uh, you go through twice as many, am you know, twice as much ammo and health kits and stuff as you would in normal mode. Oh, there's a rogue over there. There they are. Thought I saw them up here. Hey, boys, how you doing? Oh, you snuck up this way, hey? Oh. Ah, oh, come on. Throwing my uh, aim and stuff off. Oh, and here comes your brother. Oh. Oh. Meanwhile, I'm getting flanked by Lenny over here. There we go. Holy crap. Let's bandage up. Didn't want to have to use that many health kits, but... Kind of ran right into the middle of them all. I had some nails on him. Not a good boy. Oh, what did I lose there? A cloth, eh? Okay, well, let's uh, butcher these guys up. The meat I'm not too concerned about. Probably just burn it up. How are you doing? Nothing like just looking up at the sky, hey? And down at the dirt. Now, there was another dude over here, no? Oh, there's their fire tucked in over here. Didn't even see it. I'll take that ash and then I'll be popping and swearing all the way home. Now, was that it? I thought there was one more I missed. 
I may have missed. Let's get a little closer up here. Might have got them all. One, two, and then that guy down at the river bank here. So I'm pretty sure I got them all then. Just the three. I thought there was a fourth one that came in. Ah, uh, might have missed it. And I might end up missing it. No, two and three. There was only the three. Pretty sure of it. All right, let's get out of here. It's starting to get dark. Let's head back. There's a moose, but I got no room. I got no room for any more chickens either. What did I do here? I could make some cordage. Well, I'm going to be picking up fibers. You know what? I could just eat that. I got lots of grubs still back at the base. There we go. Okay. Oh, there's a crate up here too. Thirty-two nails. Not great. Not too bad. Ah. Uh, I shouldn't be hopping until I find out where the hell she went. There she is. gonna run me right into a bear when I can't see right oh didn't quite get the hand on her there we go oh over oh, on the meat okay well that's gonna be it for now what do we end up with 14 feathers that's cool there's 28 arrows right there that'll help till these other ones uh that I got in the crate mature. I actually could have kept one of the live ones and chucked it in there with them. I'm trying to take it easy on the food. Oh, and another battery. That's another thing we got to make up. ASAP. So let's do that. So there we go. Wasn't a complete waste of a day actually did pretty good picked up a few things got our extender down our our uh, plants moved over we can start adding more plant beds some raven mentioned too we'll put some decorative ones out we can just leave the veg in them or whatever Go with a little bit of color something like we did last season around our little uh, deck that we had going with the Plant beds that I put out. So we'll look at that kind of stuff. We'll get to the cosmetics a little later on. Just want to make sure we get this thing done and set up. And we'll start making it look good. Nice moonlit night. At least I can see a little bit here. Oh. Running into the walls again. All right. Well, that's going to do it. That'll take care of this week. And we, uh, like I said, next week, we'll do uh, plan to do some more raids. Oh, shit. That's no good. I had that. Uh... Ah, crap. Let's get some of this stuff put away so we can grab that. Where the hell is the light? I can't see nothing. Biofuel. I had that running and uh, got turned on a generator before we left. There we go. We should be okay. 
So yeah, I'll do some off-camera over the weekend. Maybe do, do it, run down, do another pearl run. We only got 11, and if we make those five circuit boards, that's going to clean us out. Another thing I want to do is on the pistol, I want to start working on upgrading the uh, clip capacity and the reload speed. I don't worry too much about the uh, firepower, because, I mean, the... the the 9 mil is the worst for upgrading firepower. It goes The first one goes from like 18 to 21. Then it only jumps a few more after that. But get the capacity and the reload speed up there. It works pretty damn good still. We'll eventually upgrade the, uh, the firepower as well. But there's other guns. The 44 and the shoddies are the, the best bang for the buck with upgrading. So we'll uh, work on those as well. But diving station's going to be next, so we can uh, load up on pearls. Have the ability to get over the south and do a couple good runs down there. Stuff like that. Well, that's going to do it, guys. Have yourselves a fantastic weekend. Thank you very much for taking time out of your day to come and hang out with me. It does mean a lot. We'll have some uh, action next week. I know this week was a lot of looting and stuff, but it was necessary. But next week, we'll get into some action with some raids and uh, stuff like that. So until then, just be safe, look after each other, and we'll see y'all on the next episode on Monday. Have a good weekend. Take it easy. <laughs>